you know what? That's probably how they get up on top of the fucking desk and shit. How they getting up there? <laughs> how, how I was getting up there? How I was getting up there? What are you talking about? <laughs> they digging holes in the roof, bro. Yeah. <laughs> All right. What is like being ninety-one, brother? For real, this time. We've already covered our our cut. We got rats. Um, there's always people bugging us. We tinted the windows so Sergeant Major and the Commander don't walk by and see us in here with our feet up. See, I'm in the hot tub chilling with my feet up. All right. I mean, it sucks, man. I'm going to show y'all. I don't know if this thing got zoom. Oh, shit, it got zoom. I'm going to show y'all real quick. That's a motor I had to have out in one week and put back in. You can't see it, but it's in there. Yeah, man, it sucks. Uh, a lot of deadlines. A lot of broken shit. See, at the 91 Bravo... You got these things they call ops, operators, smooth operators, right? Not so smooth. They break shit. See, they go to the field, right? And they break shit. And then you got to go to the field, and then they break shit. And then there's us, and we fix it. And like I said, deadlines. Uh, what you got to say about 91 Bravos? Sucks. Hey, what? Sucks. Yeah, it does suck. Um, from personal experience, pick the MOS with the bonus. Because financial uh, success in the military is is where it's at. Being able to take care of yourself. Because there's a lot of niggas out here who can't take care of themselves. You're going to be able to take care of yourself. If I would have took the $15,000 to be a, um, a pencil pusher, I'd have done that. Uh, no, don't do infantry. Don't don't do that. If you want to be high speed, go special forces or ranger. There is things where you can enlist into the army and and do that. And and don't just sign up because you don't think there is. You can be anything straight from signing up into the military, from officer, warrant officer, special forces. I don't really know that much about the ranger program, but I'm sure there's a way. Um. But yeah, man, check your options. Hell, you can fly pi you can fly planes. Check with your op your damn uh see I'm over here saying operator because that's that's what 91 Bravo is, operators that break shit. Don't do that. Uh but yeah, check with your recruiter and and ask him about these things. Cause you could be a motherfucking real badass soldier if that's what you want to be. And it's not infantry. You don't do that shit. Uh, but I know, bro, man, if you just sat on fucking being a mechanic and you just want to fix shit, that's, that's how I was. I did that shit. All right. You going to be a mechanic. You going to work on shit. I mean, you're more of a parts changer than you are a mechanic. I mean, you just really you order parts and you put them on. But like I said, I just pulled out a motor. If you're not even bro, you're probably going to pull out a motor sometime in your career and put one in. I'm pretty good at it. I can do that shit three days now. But if you want to be a mechanic... Be a mechanic. It ain't that bad. Um, it's really all it is is work. You do all the normal. You do all the normal army shit, PT, then work zero nine zero nine thirty depending on your unit. That shit's moving down, especially if you go to eighty second. Um, PT lasts till eight o'clock over there now. That's crazy. Zero six to eight o'clock. Um, I don't know, guys. Just uh, message me some questions. And uh, I'll try and get to you and answer the questions. I ain't, like, famous or nothing. I'm just an average guy. Or... Yeah. I've been here a long time. I still got that shit. But um, just average guy, man. Just uh, ask me some questions, man. I'll be glad to answer them.